All right, guys. Doing some UFO. UFO hunting. I'm going to need some help reviewing this footage. Hopefully we can spot some alien crafts coming off the surface. From what I'm hearing, there's like 1.5 billion uh, residents that live up there. So we should see some activity. We'll do a couple, couple scans across the bottom hemisphere of the, of the moon first. Of the southern hemisphere, then we'll do the northern. Um, be looking for flashes of light. Also, the flashes of light, mind you, you can look on the, the dark side of the moon where the shadow is, and the light should pop out a lot easier. Look at those craters. Isn't that beautiful? I apologize for my breathing. Uh, my lungs were ripped out in a car accident, pretty much. Come on, guys, where you at? Should be meditating right now. I apologize. Let's see if I can get the focus a little better. It's probably the best you're going to get it all right now. But, you know, you can do is record and hope, you know. Something's got to fly by. But the moon is huge. Those craters, I mean, those are freaking like 50 miles across the small ones. <laughs> so, a ship, if you're going to see it, it's got to be pretty freaking big. Like those, the lunar lander and all that stuff, don't, that's right there in those lava fields. But you can't see it with a telescope because it's too freaking tiny. Even this, the world's strongest telescope has trouble seeing the tracks and stuff that uh, that we left up there. But they have seen them. <clears throat> Look at that crater right there. It's like an opening to the freaking fort. It's the opening right there. Look at that thing. <laughs> See, I'm looking for fucking light flashes and shit on the dark side. Because that's where you'll see it. Sorry, I'm taking a piss. It ain't raining, I promise. Whoa, what the hell's up? Why'd that just get all foggy on me like that? That was weird, dude. I had never had that happen. Alright, I'm going to end this video. And we'll